Welcome to Babyland. This is my uh, wife and I's store that we work at. Uh, it's not our store. It belongs to the Lord Jesus Christ. But I wanted to make this video today for the glory of Jesus. Um, the reason why I'm making this video is to share with you guys something that the Lord shared with me today. This is how serious um, that the Lord Jesus is about getting our house in order, um, getting our business in order, getting... Uh, whatever it is that you're putting your hand to, uh, you need to be getting it in order with the Lord Jesus Christ. It needs to be lining up uh, to the direction and the guidance that the Holy Spirit uh, wants to have in your life. Uh, the Holy Spirit um, led me to make some interior changes to our store today. Um, he had actually convicted me of this uh, not too long ago, but a sister in Christ uh, confirmed it last night on Facebook. Uh, saying that uh, she was speaking in love, saying that it kind of made us uh, sound like hypocrites. And that's what the Lord was showing me, that uh, even though we no longer watch uh, television and the worldly uh, things like, you know, SpongeBob and Dora, um, we still had those characters on our wall here at our shop. Um, and I know it was not pleasing to the Lord. He convicted me of it uh, a month or two ago. Uh, but a sister in Christ confirmed it today, and uh, this is what we did uh, to obey the Lord Jesus Christ. Um, I was just going to take the characters down uh, and just go and totally just erase them and just uh, destroy them and get rid of them, uh, and that would have been, you know, not a, not a very hard thing to do. But the Lord led me to put these uh, no sign, you know, like these no signs, like no no smoking or no whatever. But it says no, basically saying no SpongeBob, no Dora. The Lord said to do it this way because if I did it this way, uh, when people come into our store, uh, it'll give us an opportunity uh, to to minister to them and tell them why that we did this. Uh, because the Lord said to you know love not the things of this world, uh, because if you love the things of this world. Uh, the love of the Father is not in you. So the Lord directed me uh, for his glory not to tear them down, uh, but to put these no signs over top of them. Because if we were to destroy them, yes, we'd be giving God glory by obeying him and doing it, uh, but to give him more glory uh, by being an example to others to leave this up on the wall uh, so that when others come in, uh, it'll give us a chance to, to minister uh, to them even more and to plant more seeds and to speak the truth uh, to these people. People... Please realize that whether it be television or books or CDs or DVDs or posters, magazines, uh, evil things on your computers or in your possession, uh, stolen property or, or just so many different things, those are doors that the enemy can come through. So whenever you keep those things in your possession or whenever you hold on to those things or whenever you're partaking in those things or anything of that nature, you are literally opening the door for demons, demonic spirits to come in. And, you know, it's, it's, it's the truth. And, um, my friends, people wonder why they're not getting delivered uh, from the demons. First of all, they don't really want it. Second of all, they're not taking the steps uh, that the Lord tells them to take. You know, we have to be obeying the words of Jesus. My friends, it's time to get serious. It's time to examine your home. It's time to examine uh, everything uh, that you put your hand to. If you if you, if you own your own business, uh, you know, examine your workplace there. Uh, because you could be hindering uh, the Lord Jesus blessing your business because you could have uh, some things that are defiled in your business. So my friends, I just wanted to share uh, with you what the Holy Spirit uh, showed us and confirmed through a sister in Christ. And I pray uh, that you receive it and know that the sole purpose of this was to bring glory uh, to the Lord Jesus Christ. All my wife and I want to do is to lead as many people possible to Jesus. And, you know, we are full-time disciples of the Lord Jesus Christ. And he has placed us in this store. This is his store. And we're here to do his will and his will only. May the Lord Jesus bless you and keep you. Bye-bye.